On a day that saw Jim Calhoun and the 1990 Huskies honored, Dan Hurley and his UConn squad showed a familiar grit and toughness as they upset Cincinnati. The first half was off to an aggressive start for the Huskies as Vital led the way offensively with a quick three and a few attacking drives. But unfortunately, Cincinnati had the better start as the Huskies were attacking but couldn't consistently put the ball in the basket. But it would be UConn's intensity on defense that would spark their offensive momentum. An energetic defensive stretch led to back-to-back -back threes for Adams and a deep three from Vital who would finish the first half with 14 points. Vital may have taken over the first half, but the second half was all about James Booknight. The freshman sensation picked up where he left off in Tulsa coming out on fire. UConn constantly went to book night for offense and he delivered. You know, there's so many big moments and big games ahead for that guy and to do it against a team that's that physical um, was, was an impressive. His last two games against two of the most physical teams in the country and two great defensive teams. But Cincinnati wouldn't die and both teams went back and forth in the final minutes. With just over a minute remaining, it was once again book night with a big bucket tying the game. Neither team could gain an edge in the final minute and the Huskies were heading to their fourth overtime of the season. In overtime, it would be the UConn crowd that gave the Huskies the energy that they needed to make big stops. Book Knight gave UConn the lead by hitting a pair of free throws. And it would be the defense by the Huskies in the end with two seconds left that gave UConn a 72-71 victory. This is the second consecutive big win for the UConn Huskies as they improved to 13-10 on the season and look to keep the momentum going at SMU on Wednesday. From Gamble Pavilion, I'm Samara Thacker, UCTV Sports.